Ladies, gents, welcome back to The Random. We're back. We're in for another one of our quick and dirty walkthroughs. Today, our main star is going to be Peacock, the latest in binge-worthy TV. We're talking about TV, hit movies, live sports, and so much more. First, let's make sure we're clear. Peacock is a paid app, okay? You're talking about $4.99 for their basic premium plan. In addition to that, you get the premium plus plan for $9.99 per month. Now let's turn back a little bit. For $4.99 a month, you get all the new and hit TV shows you can stand, films, originals, live sports, current NBC and Bravo TV shows, plus 50 plus always on slash live television shows. Now, this does come with some commercials. In addition to that, you have the premium plus plan. The premium plus plan Gives you no ads with some limited exclusions there. You'll be able to pick that out for yourself for $9.99 a month. Plus, you get everything in a regular premium plan. In addition to that, you get your local NBC channel 24-7. That's 24 hours a day, seven days a week, ladies and gents. Now, once you click into the Peacock app, this is where it brings you on an Apple TV. It's a gorgeous layout, as you can see. We'll scroll down. You get live banners. As you can see, you start with the featured section. Right here, we got Saturday Night Live. We'll scroll over to the latest show, Poker Face. It'll go live in a second. Let's listen and take a look. You get Megan, latest movie that was kind of a hit there, went viral. In addition to that, Bel Air. Right now, shout out to Black History Month. We're amplifying black voices. Of course, you can't go wrong with the Young Rock. So, if you like most people, what brings you to Peacock? The Office. And of course, The Office has Listen up. an exclusive, I'm in the room, please. exclusive run here. There's something I want to say. Peacock. To you, but I've so, as you saw, some of these banners are live, and some of them are more silent. The good news is, this banner goes on and on based upon what you watch, your personal interests, and of course, the latest and greatest. You scroll down, you can click on continue watching, get to see the different shows that you may have started watching, movies as well. Shout out to the Best Man Final Chapters. You get a chance to check that out. Great show. Next up, you get a chance to scroll down to My Stuff. As you can see, we have La Brea. Started watching that show in the first season. Has been nothing short of exhilarating. You have Vampire Academy. You can see the Best Man Final Chapters, Despicable Me, and of course, The Office. Who doesn't watch The Office? But let's scroll down. You get Peacock Picks. A little bit of Law & Order Special Victims Unit. The new remake here of Night Court, of course. You get items that are for you, things that they kind of pick out in the algorithm based upon your watching efforts. Like. You get things that are just added as well. So let's also talk about live and upcoming. So this is where you get a chance to see some of the different live sports that Peacock has to offer. And I can tell you it is in 4K HD and it is well worth your time. This is just some of the things here. We'll actually go into that a little bit later. So let's slide over to the side banner. When you log in, you have the option for different profiles. Of course, you have the option to search the home screen where we're at now. Movies, TV shows, sports, WWE. So if you're into wrestling like I am, no matter how many times people tell you it's fake, it's never stopped being entertaining. It lives here, including all of the live pay-per-views. So definitely feel free to check that out. And of course you have the My Stuff feature. And then last but certainly not least, you get the channels. So let's go back up to the movie section. You click in there, take a look at that. Buttery, buttery smooth. Brings you right on into Megan. I designed Megan to protect Katie from feeling lonely. And see what I love about that, it gives you a quick preview baked in. That is the ultimate user interface. And they do that for almost every TV show and movie. It's just a matter of its own time when it does activate. So these are the featured movies of the moment. Some of them are new, some of them are old. I like the mix that they kind of throw in there. You get again the things that are just added. You get to browse by genre. Look at Vin Diesel, the never ending Fast and Furious saga, of course. You get new movies straight and fresh from the theaters as well. So you know they're trying to compete with the HBO Maxes of the world, so that's always great. Benefits you, the viewer, whether it's She Said, whether it's Nope, The Silent Twins, which is pretty new and engaging. Check it all out there. And of course, if you're into it, you got bros as well. So let's come on down. 
I love the different themes that you get. As you can see, you get featured franchises, things that are action packed, that's more my space. Lucy, again, anytime it comes on, just like John Wick, I'm gonna watch it. If you're in the comedies, a little bit of comic relief, a little rom-com there with Adam Sandler, a little Jennifer Aniston, Identity Thief, Step Brothers. You already know what that's about. And of course, my favorite section is when they show you what's leaving soon. I wish more streaming services did this because it gives you an opportunity to kind of go through and know what you want to watch with a bit more urgency instead of going in and being like, ah, I just missed that. So let's click over to the side. TV shows, pretty much the same layout here. As you see, latest episodes, genres, must-see TV, just added endless episodes for those shows that just have like six, seven, eight, nine, twenty seasons. That's for you. My favorite, sports. We'll click over here and take a look. So as you can see, the Honda Classic, Supercross, if you're into that, they have what's live, the latest events. I will tell you, last year I watched the Super Bowl on Peacock, and boy, it was great. Their streaming efforts were nothing short of amazing. Um, of course, the NFL license changes hands rather quickly and all the time. So let's just click in on the NFL. Let's get a sense for what they do have right now. A lot of great content that you may not find on some of your local channels. So again, Peacock, Peacock shows you that it's worth the while. You get your top stories. You can get news by teams, different teams that you choose to follow. It's endless. The film room. So if you like me and you like to get into the nitty gritty, again, this is great stuff to watch. Let's come on over, of course, WWE. Now, shout out to Triple H and crew. As you can see, the road to WrestleMania. WrestleMania will be here in the next couple months. Get a chance to go back, visit some of your favorite pay-per-views. You can watch Steve Austin, Stone Cold, the Broken Skull Sessions. Again, WrestleMania then, now, forever. You literally have your pick of anything and everything that you like from the wrestling universe. Shout out to WCW. I know a lot of y'all watch that coming up as well. So you have the My Stuff section, which is great. You click in there. It brings you to shows that you may have added to your own uh, little network there to create so you can go uh, quick and dirty and find what you're looking for. And most importantly, you get live channels. So <clears throat> when you click on a live channel banner, keep in mind this is in real time. We'll, get her on the fast track to we'll mute that real quick. You get a chance to see. Guess what? This is what it looks like. Scroll down. As you can see, it is a buttery smooth experience. It's a riff on one would call the old style of cable, but I actually do like the fact that it reinvents the wheel a little bit in terms of the scrolling and how it goes. So once again, you get a chance to go through, you could click on something. Let's click on the Rotten Tomatoes movie channel. See how that goes there. And there it is. On occasion, it gives you a little bit of a hiccup, but for the most part, it's pretty smooth. You see this counter here down in the corner, in the left corner? That's how long you have for commercials for certain segments. So live television is certainly one of those. You can't quite fully avoid the commercials with Peacock, but you can limit them. So with that said, let's go back to the homepage. As you can see, again, Peacock is amazing. A lot of your favorite shows that you watch now, that you've watched before. Um, there's a lot of exciting exclusive content as well that takes place on Peacock. And once again, for the premium membership, $4.99 a month. For the premium plus, $9.99 a month. Ladies and gents, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you think. Have you been utilizing Peacock? Do you enjoy it? Is it not your favorite streaming service and you have another one that you recommend? We're looking to tackle all of that here on the random. And once again, if you're enjoying the content here, as I noticed that you are, because we get a chance to see you watching the videos and we're greatly, greatly appreciative of that. Hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit that like button. We'll talk to you again soon. Peace.